our intentions to get more knowledges about unknown facts, so we make lot of informations to show you. Please watch this full video. 5 Richest Beggars in the World Simon Wright This man amassed so much wealth that the government banned him from begging. Simon Wright is a resident of London, who earned around 50,000 British pounds annually by begging. His modus operandi was to sit outside the NatWest Bank in Putney High Street, wearing ragged clothes, and holding a handwritten sign that states homeless and hungry. His appearance clearly showed that the man was in a bad situation, which attracted sympathy from passers-by. He did this continuously for three years until one fateful night. Constable Oliver had regularly noticed Simon begging outside the bank and sympathized with him. One day, the officer decided to follow Simon to see where he lives, so that he could find better living arrangements for the man. The officer was in for a huge shock when he noticed Simon entering a high-end flat in Fulham that would cost around 300,000 British pounds. It turned out that Simon Bright was the owner of this luxurious flat. The London magistrate banned Simon from begging after getting to know of this situation. However, Simon broke this law and started begging a week later at Leicester Square, which got him arrested. After getting released on bail, Simon started begging near Coventry Street. He was arrested again, but this time on a non-bailable warrant. Bharat Jain Beggars are a common sight on the streets of Mumbai, India. But what no one would expect is to find a millionaire walking amongst them on the streets, begging. Bharat Jain is a rich man who earned a fortune simply by begging throughout his life. He's not only a millionaire but is among the richest beggars in the world. Bharat Jain begs for almost 8 to 10 hours every day, earning approximately 2,500 Indian rupees daily. When compared, this income is three times more than what an average Indian earns working. Along with this high income, he is also a business owner. Bharat Jain owns commercial space in Pandup, which he has given on rent. This space earns him 10,000 Indian rupees every month. Along with this, Bharat also owns two luxurious 1BHK flats in Patel Nagar that each cost 80 lakh INR. Ever since the world got to know about his wealth, Bharat Jain has become something akin to a celebrity. You can usually see him begging around Chhatrapati Shivaji Terminus or Azad Maidan in Mumbai. Aisha This lady could top the list of the richest beggars in the world. However, people were only made aware of her wealth after she passed away at the age of 100. Her childhood friend Saidi was the one who informed the authorities of her fortune. A resident of Saudi Arabia, Aisha had been begging for around 50 years. After she passed away, her assets were valued at 1 million US dollars, which includes four residential buildings. Her mother and sister were also beggars and had managed to earn a fortune, which was inherited by Aishu after she passed away. All three used to get a lot of help from charities, especially during the occasion of Eid. Aisha was not only rich in wealth, but she also had a big heart. In the flats she owned, Aisha had let many poor families stay there without paying rent. In her will, she had also stated that after she passes away, she wanted her wealth to be distributed among the poor. Erwin Corey A former celebrity, Erwin Corey has been begging for the past 17 years of his life. Erwin was a successful celebrity comedian. He made some fortune during his career before retiring. During his retirement, he took to begging full-time. What surprised many was the amount he earned every day by begging. Irwin received around 150 USD 250 every day from begging and usually walks up and down 35th Street in Manhattan to do so. Irwin Corey is a thorough philanthropist. The money he earns begging directly goes to a charitable trust in Cuba. Many people around the world are unaware of the wealth a beggar has when they give them money. However, in the case of Erwin Corey, most people who give him money know of his wealth. But due to his charitable endeavors, giving him money becomes a good idea. Sampaji Kale 
When you think of beggars, it's usually a man or woman in ragged clothes sitting helplessly. However, for Sampaji Kale and his family, begging is a profession that all four of them pursue. Living in the streets of Mumbai, Sampaji and his family beg all day, getting thousands daily. With this money, Sampaji is able to save up approximately 50,000 Indian rupees every month after expenses. This money is then invested in companies, which get him good returns. Sampaji is the proud owner of two houses and a flat in Mumbai. His investments which goes on to show that begging is not entirely a bad line of work.